What's going on guys, Jet here, welcome back to a brand new video, hope you're all having a fantastic day and today I've got another Deatomizer gameplay for you this time, it is with the MacTab on throwback, let's jump into it. So the gun I'm using today is the MacTab, also known as the UMP, and my attachments are Grip, Extended Magnet Suppressor, and my perks are Dexterity, Blind Eye, Scavenger, and Dead Silence, and by now you guys know that's pretty much my standard perk setup. Sometimes I won't have blind eye. Well, most of the time I won't have blind eye, but I've had an extra spot here. Um, so yeah, I decided to chuck blind eye on just in case they managed to get a warden or um, vultures. The vultures are really um, but yeah, this is kind of a slow start to the gameplay, but it kind of picks up towards the end. Um, and in this gameplay, I'm pretty much just using my mini map to its advantage to the fullest, and also um, sound whoring like crazy. So that's why you've probably seen me turn this way, turn that way a couple of times. So yeah, thanks to get that dude. I have no idea what he was doing there. Maybe just hard scoping. Um, so yeah, guys, I will have a couple more deatomizer gameplays coming. Um, hopefully one Wednesday, one Friday. Um, yeah, that should be the days that they come out. So yeah, hope you guys enjoy. And I'm gonna start be streaming a lot more, hopefully. So yeah, make sure you subscribe to the channel and also follow me on Twitch because come to the start of World War II, I'm going to um, be streaming over on Twitch instead of YouTube. I will probably upload them as a video after on YouTube. But yeah, so guys, make sure you're over there. Make sure you're following me on Twitch. I'll leave a link in the description. And also, it is just the same name, GTI Jet, all one word. So yeah, just follow me over and make sure you turn on the notifications so you know when I go live. And also, if you're on YouTube, make sure you subscribe to make sure you've hit the bell to make sure you're getting notified straight away as well. So yeah, there was a guy running around with a Venom X on this map um, that I had to watch out for. He was going to just spraying it like crazy. So yeah, sound hall, but there was a teammate. And that time I actually wasn't looking at my mini for some reason. See this guy rewind, so I know he's coming back for me. To peek around, go no, rewind out of that situation. So, here I'm thinking, geez, we're down by 10. Um, really got to start picking my game up a little bit. Especially get that dude on 480 to 5 Down holding to the max, man. Just trying to get that guy. Um, that was pretty much where I could have choked my deatomizer the most. Get that dude as well. Now, with that UAB, I see two in that building and I see one there. Managed to get that dude. And now I'm just going to sit up here and just wait. See if they come down at all or come through there. So no one seems to be moving yet, but now I see sweeping. They're moving. Managed to get that dude. And then I decide to move around because the last thing you want to do is stay in the same spot for too long because that'll just give them more opportunity to kill you by knowing exactly where you are. So make sure whenever you get a kill, you're just moving straight away afterwards. Probably the best um, way I can tell you. Yeah. Just keep moving. But yeah, get my advance there. I'll call it in in just a sec. Managed to pull it in before I did. Probably could have killed that dude before. But yeah. Put it in. Open fire. And now I'm only like 13 kills off, I think. Maybe even 12. I can see that dude coming around on the advance. Pre, pre aim for him. Pretty, pretty good. I was going to go that way. Just to see him coming this way. So, yep, pre aim. Get him there. 10 kills off. And now there's a few here. And what am I going to Am I going to rush? Not quite yet, but then I do push. See that dude. They managed to get that dude, now I'm just going to flank back around the other way because that's one part I really don't like running towards. Um, yeah, just so, just so open, managed to get a nice double kill there. Gives me about 5 or 6 off. Yeah, do that dude. Managed to get that dude. Make sure I grab a scab pack, it was almost out of ammo there. There I am just looking at my mini map, saying which way do I want to go. 
all in all, I don't think it would have made a difference where I went then, because I went to this room. Make sure there's no one hiding up there. Check there quickly. Nope, no one's coming. See that most of my teammates are on the other side. So, start flanking this side again. Teammate manages to get in, so I'll reload quickly. Bad habit, but was pretty safe there. Does get me killed uh, more times than not. And choking the atomizer as well. That was probably another place where I probably could have lost my atomizer there. That dude had no idea what was going on. He was getting shot by two people. And he also kind of just stands there. Two kills off here. So I was going to go back to my, my, my nice little uh, spot to look at the barn through, but I decided not to. Managed to get up here, get this dude. Still two kills off. Make sure there's no one camping up there. See this dude running out. Shoot him. Now I'm two kills off. Managed to see that guy coming. Get over him, get him, leave my advance. One kill off. And pretty much here I'm like, come on, I can do this. This dude rushes me and there's the reatomizer. So yeah, got it. Tied up 70 also. That is where I know that he's dead, he's in, but then I die. So, die going for the Juggernaut, but I got the Atomizer, which means we got the W in this game, which is a good thing. Um, yeah, as I said, it was a really tight game, as it probably still is. As you guys can see, it's 75 to 74. Um, yeah, so, I'll go on every way up in this game, trying to make sure we win. Drop a Atomizer, so you do what I go. Um, I'll call it in at about 85, like I always do. 85 for me is a good time. You get the 15 kills to get called in. It takes about 9 seconds, 10 seconds to get called in. And I want to make sure I do drop that to the Get a nice one. I'll be there. Call in my counter. Oh, sorry, I'll call it in in just a sec. Call it in right there. Let's get that dude to try to shoot out by the atomizer. Which is funny, because you can't shoot him down. Four seconds left, make sure we get the W, die there, doesn't matter, we have to die anyway, and there we have it guys. The guys die, we win 92 to 81, and I go 27 and 2. There you are guys, so I hope you guys have enjoyed the video, if so, don't forget to like and subscribe for more, and if you haven't already, check out my Twitch, until next time, I am out.